In this video, I will show you how to use AutoDS for Etsy dropshipping. I'll show you everything you can do using AutoDS to enhance the AutoDS dropshipping experience, from importing products to fulfilling orders, and literally everything that AutoDS can help you with. So first of all, you want to go and create an AutoDS account. Now, usually they offer a 14-day trial for $1, but if you sign up through the link down in the description, you will get an extended 30 day free trial. So if you would like to claim that, go and click on the link down in the description to get started. Then here, go to sign up with Google or enter your email address, phone name and password. Then right here for your selling channel, you want to go and select Etsy in the bottom left. Now here you will see they have 30 day free trials on any package if you sign up through the link down in the description. Even on the most expensive package you will be able to get the 30 day free trial. Now you can set it to monthly billing in the top right. And my personal favorite package is the starter 500, the one in the middle. Because right here you will get the price and stock monitoring which is a really great feature. On top of that you will get two and a half times more products that you can import onto your Etsy store. So I'm just going to start my 30 day free trial in this package. Now in order to get started, just enter your payment details right here. So then after you register, go ahead and close this and then click on add store in the top left. Now from here, we can go ahead and connect our Etsy shop. So click add store. Now I already have a tab open right here. So for me, it will just log me in automatically. So an application would like to connect to your account. You want to go ahead and click on grant access. So then you have connected AutoDS to your Etsy store. Now next you can go and close this as well. And you will get to the AutoDS marketplace. Now I'll show you both how you can import products from the AutoDS marketplace and how you can add your own products. So for example, these products right here, I could imagine doing very well on Etsy. So let's go and import some of these products by clicking on import draft right here. Then here you can head into your drafts and you'll see it's now in progress and it will be done. So go ahead and click on the drop down right here. Now you can optimize the title and description using AI. So just click AI right right there. So now it has created a new title and description and it looks a little bit weird right here, but it will look really good on Etsy and I'll show you that. So then go ahead and click save and now you can go ahead and change the pricing and stuff like that. And I always recommend turning on the stock and the price monitoring so that when the supplier runs out of stock, you won't keep selling it on Etsy and start losing money. That's one of the best features in AutoDS in my opinion, because there are more fulfillment and importing services out there. But AutoDS will also help you make sure that you don't sell your products when your supplier increases the price and you're selling at a loss or when your supplier runs out of stock. So for now, let's go and click on import in the top right. So as you can see, the product import to your store has filled. Etsy product shipping and return policies must not be empty. So I forgot to add that in. To go and change that, to go and change that, here you have the shipping policy and the return policy. So for the shipping policy, you can see no data, return policy, no data. So in order to go and change this, head into your settings in the bottom left. And then here you can see all your suppliers. Now this one is coming from the AutoDS marketplace. And if you click on it right here, you will see that this right here is the supplier. So let's click on their store. You can also see they have a bunch more products that would do really good on Etsy, I think. But since I cannot copy their policies, I'll just take that of AliExpress since it is a Chinese supplier. So then I'll click copy from another provider and here select AliExpress and then click add supplier. And then here you can see the shipping methods and then the shipping policy and return policy. And by the way, right here in the drafts, you have the shipping policy and return policy, but right now I cannot pick anything and you cannot fix this from within AutoDS. Instead, you want to head over into Etsy, then go to your shop and click settings. And then from settings right here, you want to click on policy settings, and then you want to go and create a policy. Now you can either choose to accept the returns of this item and accept exchanges. And then here you can choose the time frame and then click save and apply. Now you will see that you have created this policy right there. So right here in the AutoDS marketplace, for example, I'll take this water bottle and click import draft. Now it will show up in my drafts right here. From here you can see it. Now here you can go and change the title, the description and stuff like that. You can also optimize it with AI. 
so then once you're happy with how everything looks go and click on save and import now before importing you do want to add a category so for example let's say this is this then you can add that and then click save and retry so now the product has been added and you can see now here if i go to my products you will see it right there also if i head into my etsy shop and then here click on listings you will now see that i have these two products right here so this is the water bottle that we just imported you can see it took all the pictures and stuff like that now they have been cropped a little bit so you want to go and fix that and you will see the description has been added in and the pricing right here you can go and change it if you want but basically now when you get an order AutoDS will handle the order fulfillment for you and they will show up here in your orders and your auto order credits right here will be used to go ahead and order this product and send it out to your and send it out to your customer on Etsy. Now to fully set this up you want to go and click settings right there then here click on buyer accounts and then click on add account so that you do actually have an account or a credit card or payment method to pay for the products that AutoDS then ships out to your customers. So you can also click on add products and then import a product from any of these suppliers. For example, I'll go with AliExpress and enter a URL right here. For example, if I would like to sell this product, then I can just go and take the product link right here. Then go to AutoDS and paste it in here. And then you can either edit it first or you can publish it directly to your store. And if you do that, it's really fast. And when you click add products here, you can also import multiple products from one store at once. So now if I head into my products right here, it is going to show up, but it's still in progress as you can see. Now you can also do print on demand using AutoDS, which is a less known feature. If you want to do that, then you can also just go ahead and do that through AutoDS but that's not what I'm focusing on in this video. Now on the AutoDS marketplace, they often do have some pretty cool products that will work well on Etsy. For example, this Halloween party decoration kit. I'm just going to import this draft because I think when Halloween comes around, that could be a very good product to sell on Etsy. So again, then go to your drafts, then you will see it here, then click import or go and edit it first, of course. So now you do know the basics of importing products from suppliers such as AliExpress and Amazon onto your Etsy store using AutoDS, how you can do the order fulfillment using AutoDS, but if you have some questions about specific stuff, then you can head into their customer support right here, and right here you can see all your messages, and in order to send a message, just click in the bottom right on the chat icon, and then right here just click on start chat, and then ask whatever question you have. Now you will see if it is online and usually it is so you can just go and get help with your questions pretty much instantly. So now you know how to use AutoDS for Etsy. Again if you want to get the extended 30 day free trial instead of the usual 14 day $1 trial then go and sign up to AutoDS using the link down in the description. If this video was helpful please consider leaving a like and subscribing to my channel. With that being said I will see you in the next video.